Uh, hello guys, welcome back to Let's Play Subnautica. As you can see, we're back down in the depths, uh, with this nice flowery biome. Um, the reason is because of that. Um, I decided to come down here so I could collect some materials to create the grappling arm, which I was able to get the recipe for. I need, uh, those floating, uh, glowing lights we saw earlier, last set, to, uh, make benzene. So, I kind of need to come down here. And as I did, I kind of fell down a hole. Which naturally means I found an, an, an alien artifact. Naturally. Sorry, take a drink. Uh, while I was out and about, I was able to get the horsepower mod for the sea truck. So now I can carry um, uh, three additional trailers without being slowed down, which is great. Well, it slows down, but not by a lot. I can carry four, but it's still, it cuts the speed in half, and I don't want that. Um, what else did I do? <clears throat> um, I found another, um, uh, alien cache, which gave me the ability to create ion batteries and, uh, power cells, which I've yet to do. And that's about it. <laughs> I've been upgrading, um, uh, my base as well, which we'll get to when we get back to base. But I saw this, and I'm like, huh, this is different. So I'm curious. Let me in. I also got the rebreather a while ago too. Oh. So yeah, I got the rebreather. I can finally breathe underwater without dying. Hooray. Ooh. This is pretty. I wonder if I can, uh, take this. No. Okay. Is there a point to this location? This is the place that Alan was talking about last time, so... Huh. Either way, I want to screen cap this place. Oh, I see what I need. Alright, so this is one of the recipes we need for Alan. It, uh... Let's go have to swing check it out. We need tissue, the skeleton, which we just got, and organs. Uh, that's not that bad to make. This skeleton is very dense, able to handle heavy forces. A good friend from my new form. Are you okay, Alan? It is not often that I gaze upon the form of a foreign architect. Is this place another sort of sanctuary? It's peaceful. Beautiful. As the bacteria spread, the continuation of life became uncertain. This is a place to reflect. I think I understand. It's pretty. Let's pick up again. Alright. So, uh, yeah, I like this place. Alright, that wasn't a, uh, waste. Welcome aboard, Captain. Thank you, Matt. Let's get out of here. Yeah, I need to collect uh, a few of these. I only need two, but I decided to collect a few more. Alright, we're good. Let's get the hell out of here. Naturally, a cricket starts chirping once I start recording. I kind of wish I could grow these plants outside my base. Oh well. Going up. I did collect a few more uh, alien eggs too. Like two more. Not really sure what they're used for though. Oh boy. 
That's not good. Okay, we're good. Also, while I was... I, I'm going to include it in the beginning of the set, if I can remember to. Um, I did find Marguerite's base. Um, complete accident. I was just roaming around some sea monkey nests, and all of a sudden she contacted me saying, Hey, I told you to back off. So, we have that now. I'll swing by our base once we get uh, out of here. Here. Land. Oh. oh. I need more of these. Come on. There we go. Now that I have a nuclear reactor, I need to make sure I have uh, fuel, so... Gotta collect a few of these. Keep going up. Oh. Right, where... Uh, I can't tell you how much I'm gonna appreciate the grappling hook once I get it. Fucking hell. I also was able to come across some nickel ore. Um, in the same location we'll be going. It was in a, a sea monkey nest right next to the freaking uh, Mercury 2 thrusters that we found a while ago. Going up. Where's Ilya at? There she is. Other side of this, uh, rock. Oh. Alright, let's get over there. <coughs> Something behind me in there. That cricket, I swear to God. I think there's one more, uh, what you call it, piece of the mercury we can find somewhere, but I don't know where. Alright, there's Ilya. How you doing, girl? Land. Let's hook up. Here we go. And how much did I get out of that run? A fair few. Also, these eggs. I'm not sure what they are. Let's go inside so I don't drown while I'm looking through my stuff. Oh, fuck. Alright. Let's see here. Uh, don't need this. Turn that off. I marked the path to uh, Marguerite, so there we go. Also, this is the sleeping uh, module. Has a picture frame. I decided to put a picture of the picture we found a while ago. All I did to get this picture is just get really close to it and screen cap it. Uh, jukebox, my storage room, which has my uh, secondary quantum locker. I have one currently set up outside my base. Actually, you know what? Let's actually uh, demonstrate it. go. I'll drop as much as I can to it. Oop. One, two, three, four. There we go. Alright. I can also use it as a on-the-go on uh, storage facility, like the... Uh, uh, duffel bag I mentioned that we got from the Aurora crash. How it should have been that. We can use that in a similar fashion too. If we, uh, the way I want it to work. 
but unfortunately, that one didn't work. But we can do it this way, though. It was cool. Fuck it right here. Drop. Jeez, it it slid. Oh, motherfucker, come here. All right, down we go. Let's go see Marguerite. This is how I usually use uh, beacons, by the way, as a pathfinding uh, device. Even though we have a pathfinder tool, this is how I use the beacons. I just never can figure out how the, path, the, path, the pathfinder works. Here it is. I've already scanned uh, this, the uh, roof here, so I can put this on the larger buildings if I want to now. Fun side note, we actually can find this place before meeting Marguerite on the island. And if we do, her uh, prawn suit isn't here. I think we can even dock here if we uh, want to. Customize prawn suit. I want that sword. Uh, I'm low on food and water. Hold on. I told you to stay off my land. You trained that thing? Next time I'll let him tear you to ribbons, Altera. I'm not with Altera. I'm Robin Ayu. I'm looking for information about my sister Sam. I think you might have crossed paths. Bull crap. I suggest you take the time you need to come to your senses and then get off my sea base. If you're not, Altera, why don't you disable that damn tracking satellite tower instead of barging into my sea base? Maybe once Altera's off my back, I'll remember something about your sister. There's some junk on that table that might help. I couldn't get it to work. That, by the way, is a snow stalker. We find them later. I'll right, scan this. Snow Fox Frag, which I think is the last one I need. Nope, one more. Lovely. I'd die from exhaustion long before I made it to shore. All I could do was survive long enough to wash up somewhere. I felt a suction, and suddenly, there were vast jaws rising out of the water towards me. It had taken hours for the Reaper's corpse to float to the surface. Using the knife, I clambered up her flank and got a perch on top. I figured she'd float for a few days at least, enough for me to catch my breath. But would she sink before or after I died of thirst? I had a knife, a repair tool, and three liters of water. At least I wasn't gonna die of exhaustion. Now, those reefers, they're practically all muscle, but there's some fat in there. I was able to keep warm and drink the water. And I didn't have much, but I had that repair tool, so I had a spark. It took a week to light that first fire. And I know more about the burning properties of reaper fat than I ever cared to. I had to ration fires, but as they burned, I could smoke meat that I carved out of the beast's rib cage. Respect! Oh, I, wish I, I wish I could scan this and build it. Alright. That's okay, Fluffy. Yeah, I'll see anything else. 
at least not for a while. Actually, you know what? We weren't raised in a barn. Alright. I actually like her uh, little alcove here. This little section right here where her, her prawns just drops into. I wonder if that's just due to uh, natural drops or uh, long, long periods of time over time, uh, drops over time, or if she uh, built her base there just because of it. Actually, there's something over here we can go check out. Oh crap, my stamina. Oh, time to find another alien base. A power. Nice. Oh, this actually is a really good spot. I'd build a base here. Running and running to power only? What? Oh, I know what that was. Okay. Yeah, that makes sense. Don't worry, we'll, we'll uh, get to that. Prob possibly next set, maybe a set or two from now. But there is a volcanic area around here somewhere I can go to. But it looks like her entire base runs on uh, thermal energy. Because all these are thermal. And that giant uh, thermal tree over there is pretty good. I think it's over here. Gotta be careful not to go too deep. Oh, no, 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 no. I know what this is. Did not realize she had a direct connection to it, though. Okay. Uh, <laughs> so this tells me this is an endgame area, these crystals. What sucks is there's some nasty motherfuckers down here. Why does Marguerite have a direct connection to this place? What's that? Yeah, yeah, I, I can see that being down here. Actually, might be something interesting down here. Alright, so I'm about to be very careful here. Like I said, there's some nasties down here. Proceed with caution. A Leviathan class creature is near. Yeah. Yeah, about right. Five hundred. Won't be able to get me down here. Honestly, oh no, there it is. Oh no, get me out of here. Get me out of here. That was a shadow leviathan. I do not want to play with a shadow leviathan right now. Why in the hell is your base connected to this biome? I, I really honestly did not know this place, this place was connected to it. Ooh, that, that's useful. I gotta find the propulsion cannon. Get me out of here, get me out of here, get me out of here. 
I am done playing with Marguerite. I want to take my ball and go home. <laughs> now, Reaper Leviathan, creepy. Scary shit. Um, the Fire Dragon, horrifying. Um, uh, 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 the uh, Empress, adorable. Shadow Leviathan freaks me the hell out. Not because he's actually terrifying or anything like that, or he's, you know, any different than, from the other Leviathans. He just makes me uncomfortable the way he moves. And looks, and just, ugh. The only way I know to get to the, that biome, apart from this spot now, is, uh... Through the big vents. The, big, the giant purple vent we saw last time. It connects straight down to, into there. But we can find Kyanite down there. Um, there's, there's another one of uh, Alan's uh, things down there. So ugh. that's going to be fun to work on. Problem is, it's all really deep. So I need to upgrade my depth module. So yeah, that's all end game stuff. I could have easily jumped and dropped straight into that endgame area. Fucking hell. Right, where is... There she is. Oh. Fuck. Fuck off. Oh, I killed one. Oh, you're the one that's been following me around for like years, aren't you? Oh, I'm so sorry, buddy. Connect. Yeah, that, uh, Brute Shark has been following me around for, like, ages. And I, uh, just give it a pop every so often. Apparently, uh, he, uh, he's done playing. Right, back to base. Oh, I can't believe my base is so close to that entrance. That's gonna make things interesting. Let's... Even out a bit. Drop you. Disconnect you. Let's park you. Welcome aboard, Captain. Uh, don't walk me aboard yet. I'm gonna be back in a second. There we go, now I'm back. Upgrades. Eh, I'll worry about that later. Alright, so the upgrades I made to my base while I was away. Uh, this is now where my study is, or my uh, workroom. I like having this set up because it's like I have a computer monitor, I'm like studying the ping the ping link thing. Uh, this is my new water and uh, frost vase. This way I can just gather the salt as needed, as well as uh, these, so I can make the water purification tablets. Let's also drop that off. Ah, my plants are growing nicely out there. Um, let me, let's put in this, real quick. Give any, uh, nasty leviathans around me a little <laughs> if they get too close. i uh, reorganize my, uh, fun room. So, this is my new alien containment. I have a sea monkey. Raised him from birth. Bedroom! And this will be the bathroom once I get everything done. 
scanner, my new uh, generator. How's it running? Still good. Also, apparently, uh, when we got the upgrades, uh, when we got one uh, one of the alien artifacts, I got this beauty. The Recyclotron. I love this thing. Uh, let me see if I can find an example of how it works for you. Uh, this should do. So something that I don't want, like a battery. And if you look to the bottom, it will tell, me, tell us what it took to make it. And then, get the materials back. It's all very useful, honestly. Store we don't need. Actually, I need two of those. Store those. Okay. Quantum locker. And that's how that works. So freaking useful. I should be able to make... Benzidine. I need a ribbon plant. Luckily! I've got to make two just in case I need one later on. Alright. What's this? Test overdrive. Lead. I need to get lead? Fucking hell. Okay. Z truck, the upgrade, don't need to worry about that. Oop. Grappling arm. Yeah, we can now make uh, mods here. That, um. Uh, what you call it? Vehicle bait thing is purely just for co for affecting with cosmetics now. Which doesn't, bo doesn't bother me in the slightest. Alright, let's see what these eggs are. Hey, buddy. I'm gonna hatch one for right now. I found it inside that little, uh, cave near where we got Alan Skelton. Not really sure what it does. I'm assuming it actually might make one of those uh, squid fish. Ah, sorry, my hair. <sighs> ah. By the way, the power isn't. There's nothing wrong with my power right now. I do have uh, solar panels up, and uh, during the day they go away. The power goes away, so or during the night it does. Someone here? Um, if hit the doorbell again, I'm gonna go. But, turn these off. Oop, turn the bow rack. Alright. Now that we have the freaking stuff, let's head over there. Let's see what we can learn about uh, what happened here. Oof. Something's behind me. Jump. Sorry, listen, listening upstairs. Alright, we're good. Alright, we want to go in here real quick. Uh, where's my laser cutter? There it is. Let's go! Ah, oh, it's so nice having a breather not dying every five seconds. Um, oop. 
I need to get into there. If I had a freaking propulsion cannon, it'd be a lot easier, but yeah. Like that. Give me that. There we go. I could have sworn there was a vent in here. Oh well. Don't see anything. Oh, hello. Wait. Depleted. I don't need that. Alright, let's return to my head and give myself another breath. Actually, let's head up here first. Power cell. Break that down. Wiring kit. Nice. Could always use more of those. Oh boy. Wreckage diving, I swear. get into there somehow. Ah! Maybe this door will be the way in. Come on. Kinda wish there was a way to upgrade my laser cutter so it goes faster, you know? Let me in. Let me in. There we go. Chinese potatoes. Hello. Oh man, oh man, oh man. This is every xenolinguist's dream. <sighs> I mean, I was helping with the planetary scans, and there are possible unknown structures on the surface. This could set my career up for life. The images are a little degraded coming through the atmosphere, but it looks like intentional and complex architecture, <laughs> which means civilization, and civilization means <laughs> dun -dun -dun -dun, language. Oh, man. And now, most of the crew wants to get home. I, I understand that, but this could be a defining discovery. I'm definitely going to put a bug in Diana's ear about going to the surface so I can take a team to explore. I desperately hope this pans out. Oh, I can't wait till we get into communication range with Soul again. Now I just need to build the test override module. Then I can disable that satellite tower. All right. Don't want to get too cocky like last time. So... Confirmed. Warning. 30 I know. Seconds of oxygen. They uh did find proof, but they were told not to talk about it. Huh. Get back. All right, let's see if there's anything in here that I missed. Not in there. And here. There's probably uh, another reactor rod in there. Let's worry about it later. Alright, let's go to the top. There are we. Ooh, hello. Orion's belt this all went sideways. How could I have known that so much would go wrong? I failed my crew. No. I don't fail. I didn't get into this position by being a failure. It's this desolate land. Frigid. Cursed. Between these tunneling creatures, and the strange sickness that a few of the crew are showing symptoms of, we have to leave at first light tomorrow. We are prepping for a rapid takeoff. We can't take chances with the vibrations drawing the tunnelers, so we're skipping the systems check. Risky, but I have faith in myself and the crew of the Mercury. Landing this thing was practically a miracle, though. But we have to get out of here. Maybe the weapon is to keep people away, but if we leave, it'll let us go. 
I have to leave the quarantined crew in the cave behind. We will be back for them. But we can't risk an unknown infection spreading through the mercury. We're packing survival kits for them, but there's only enough surplus for about two weeks. I'm telling them that we will come back. But I don't think I can land here safely. Twice. I hate this. But I have to leave them behind. I can't risk the entirety of the Mercury. Alright, so it sounds like this was years ago during the Karara Plague. And... They, tr they landed safely. Found aliens. Were excited. And then they found out that they were infected. And by the looks of it, they tried to leave, and the automated system shut uh, shot them down. Oof. Feel bad for them. They just wanted to leave. And who would have thought it just it would have taken someone you know, not even a month to be able to get out of there. He was just annoyed. All right, let's get out of here. Where is the exit? This way. Hello. Water and food, thank you. Oh, that's the mess hall. But to explain all the potatoes all over the place. I am confused. I have no clue where I'm at. Up, maybe? I need an oxygen plant. Come here. Okay. Um. Where the hell am I? Oh, I know where I'm at. Okay. Gotta swim through this. And up this. Alright, we're good. Whoo! But, we're able to get the parallel processing unit, which we can use to, uh, fix the, uh, drop the, uh, um, satellite. We should also have the hydraulic fluid to extend the bridge, I believe. Well, let's head back to base and find out. So yeah, I was right. The ship that we saw in the opening wasn't this ship. Um, I keep hearing that uh, we were on the Mercury, which is why I keep thinking this is the our ship. But this ship was uh, was probably the the, the Degrassi type, the, the 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 ship that brought the Degrassi team. I keep calling it Degrassi. I don't know if that's actually their name, but uh, brought them here probably. Landed safely, which is a freaking miracle. Know that. Orbital gun was shot them out of the sky, like it did to the Aurora. But they survived, and when they tried to leave, got blown to bits, like the uh, the Sunbeam. So lovely. All right. Welcome aboard, Captain. Thank you. Okay. Let's eat some peppers. Alright, what's we'll take to make it? Gold, silver, and a table coral sample. Oh, I have all that already. Oh, mouse over. That's okay. I can fix that. Love this thing. Right, let's store this urine so I can make the stuff later. 
store one silver. The extra titanium. Okay. Didn't I get the hydraulic fluid? Grab the pressing unit. Titanium, lead, copper wire. I think I have just enough materials to make that too. Lead, copper, one titanium. Okay. Oh, there's a hydraulic fluid. I'm an idiot. Okay. Got that. And the hydraulic fluid was... Seed cluster and... Four? Four gel sacks. Okay. Oop. Easy enough. Cluster two, shit. Uh, yoink! Come on, come on. There we go. And in we go. And with that, we can fix the bridge. Awesome. Uh, we have plenty of time. Yeah. Okay. Let us sleep. Just checking on my monkey, make sure he's uh, okay. Ah. Hello, Penglings, how you doing? Hello, buddy. You're gonna have a friend soon. He's right there, he's hatching. Alright, so we want. Uh, let's see, turn that off. These two. Okay. Save. Alright, we don't need to bring my head with us or anything uh, else, really. I'll worry about those later. Okay. Same controls to uh, power that thing. Gotcha. Still gotta build a thermal plant for that. Alright, so first things first, let's turn off the, uh, the thing. That was creepy. I actually might grab... Oop, might grab the uh, beacon here to play somewhere else. Depending on how uh, this goes. And uh, make a new one, put it, uh, put it back here later. Because it's right next to my base, so. Alright. Uh, up we go. So we're going up to that. This way, I think. Doesn't really matter, it all leads the same way. Here. Up 
war. <laughs> Keep running. Warm up. Alright. Whoop. Alright, let's uh, sabotage our terror attack. Fun side note, you can do all of this before even meeting Alan. Alright, uh, enter test mode. Do it. Please work. Warm back up. All right. So it seems like we have to go back to uh, Marguerite's base. That's fine. Uh, I was able to. Uh, oh, never mind. All right, Altera, you win this round. Come find me at my greenhouse. I'm about a kilometer east of your position up on an iceberg. I have a present for you. I'll come by if I have time. <laughs> sure. Whatever. If you have time for me in your busy social calendar. She likes us. Alright, so east, she said. Okay. This uh, greenhouse is kind of what I've been jonesing for the entire freaking game. Because with it, we can make the best food in the game. I still have my... Good. Do, 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 do. Let's head back to the base. Well, not back to the base. Let's head out to the Marguerite, to the east. We're also gonna, like I said, grab that... Beacon, so we can put Beacon up at her uh, greenhouse. So I can check it out later. Alright, uh, sea truck. So she said to the east. That way. This is gonna be, uh, a fairly interesting drive. Because we're kinda going out over deep water with a bunch of nasty leviathans out there. Luckily I now finally have my uh, pr uh, proximity defense system. So we should be fine. Down they go. We just gotta find an iceberg out here. Huh, wonder where an iceberg is. Not this one, though. Hey, Glow Whale. You having a good time? That's good. Oh, pot of Glow Whales. I was trying to make a, a base out here, but I just couldn't do it properly. I really should have done this ahead of time. That is what I think I'm looking for as a place marker. So this is. I think this might be it actually. Oh boy. Just gotta find the Sure. Is this it? Or is it... No, it's somewhere else, because the one I'm looking for has a 
beacon type thing on top of it. Not beacon, but flashing light. That might be it right there. That's not it. Oh great, now it's hailing. Actually, it kind of helps. It clears out the uh, place a bit. We should be closer. I don't think I'm in the safe spot. Oh great, it's getting dark out. Lovely. Damn, I should have brought my I should have brought the, the cargo. Fuck. And that does not help in the slightest. I have no idea where I'm at. <laughs> West. <laughs> it's actually kind of terrifying. So while there are no Reaper Leviathans or Ghost Leviathans in this game, uh, that giant red squid monster that attacked us a while ago, there's a few of those around here. Oh, here it is. And there are uh, bigger giant variants of those that I do not want to fuck with. Yeah, this is it. Right, where is Beacon? Beacon, Beacon, Beacon. Let's plop it right here. House. There we go. Oh, it's the uh the the rip cage of the of the Reaper Leviathan she uh found. Or that she killed and rode here. She kept the skull though. That's Honestly, that's fucking that's fucking baller. <laughs> that's that's totally uh, awesome. What the hell is that? We'll screen cap that and check it out later. Actually, I might just do it once we get done with this. I think I went the wrong way. Am I even on the right island? Oop. It is, because I remember there being, it was the skeleton with uh, the lights. And these guys here. I guess I just went the wrong way. No. Climb up, lights. Keep climbing up. I guess I just got distracted by that light. Yeah, here it is. Here's here it is. Marguerite's greenhouse. Is there anything around it? Nope. This place is locked, by the way, if you come here later on. Damn, 
damn satellite hasn't passed by in a while. I guess that was your doing. Sam's not the only one in the family who knows, knew, what to do with vague directions and old wire. She was an original, that sister of yours. First time I met her, I was sure she was Altera through and through. Not a crease in her uniform. Sending those damn bird bots to spy everywhere. Then, she surprised me. Maybe a little too much. Meaning? If you really want to know, there's a PDA on the bench that can point you in the right direction. You need anything else? Don't bother me. <laughs> but you can help yourself to three The least I can do to repay you for getting those spine pests off my back. Alrighty then. Let's scan her. You can look all you want. There's more to Marguerite than any damn fangled gadget can see. Mm-hmm. I like Marguerite. Hey, buddy. So these are called the pressed implants. Uh, these... Ooh, wall planter. I want that as well. The uh, leaves on these plants, combined with the fever peppers, makes the best fruit in the game. High food, high water, and high body heat. But you need to cut them, so... Yeah. Uh, first things first, let's do the scan run. Go. I've already synthesized an antidote and stashed it in a cave. I can go grab it and... That's your plan? You don't think it'll work? <sighs> you're thinking too small. Like maybe if you're polite enough about destroying the bacteria, Altera will come around and see it your way. But do you believe in yourself or not? I think so. You think so? Come on! Is a bacteria a threat? Or isn't it? It is. Does it need to be dealt with or not? It does. So who's right on this? I am. Say it like you mean it! I am. I said like you mean it, not like you're testifying before a rigged transgov court. I am. Great! Then what you gotta do is seal off the whole cave. I've got just the stuff. Made it for fishing, but it blew the whole ice shelf halfway to deep space. Vaporized all the fish. Okay. And you gotta hit the lab, too, or there's just no point. Actually, you know what? Let me take care of that one. It'll be fun. All right, Marge, old girl. We hate this greenhouse. So here are some pointers to remember so we never have to do the worst parts again. Too bad you can't fight malnutrition by hunting it down and killing it. So, first thing, insulation. First few nights, the soil was rock solid. Ended up having to insulate the damn place with dehydrated kelp. Adding a thermal mass helped, too. Heat from barrels of water. Probably should have just eaten the damned kelp. But, nope, my body was craving a salad. Wish I was just made of exosuit. Next, grow lights were a must-have. Gotta admit, I felt pretty proud of my first full crop of lettuce. Fed half of it to Preston. That snow stalker will eat practically anything. Always spits half of it out, though. Another thing we have in common. The slobbery green mess makes good compost. So Preston's the name of this guy. Aww. Alright. Let's take a few of these plants with us. Alright, leave those there for her, and let's go. I don't want these plants going bad because they do decay over time, so... I think. That was just a fruit. Alright, so where was that glowing green? It was over there. Alright. Oh, that's gonna hurt! That's gonna hurt! Just... Okay. So it was this glacier. It 
looks like there's gonna be something up here. I've never saw that before, so I'm curious. What is that? Oh! Sight is one of some significance. Its data will assist us on our quest. Spread us all out from where I was. <laughs> it's a crashed architect satellite. The fuck? Don't wanna know. Let's head back to base. Although I am going to show this off because this is one of my favorite little features about these guys. Oh, it was a squid shark. Okay, cool. Hey, buddy. Oh, he's eating. Uh, come on. Ah, damn it. Interact. Whee! I can't control it, but I can ride on it. I can also, if I get... There it is. Hey, buddy. Good fish. Or good mammal. I love glow whales. You can find glow whale eggs and grow them in your hatchery. I just don't remember where to find them. Right, where is... Where's Illy at? There she is. I had a baby glow whale in one of my uh, previous playthroughs. It was so cute. Oh. Oh, hi. Okay. Whew! Alright, back on. Let's go. <laughs> if I would have kept on going earlier, I would have swum right into the uh, dead zone. Or whatever. What, what constitutes a dead zone in this game? Since there technically isn't a dead zone anymore, I guess. Yeah, would there still be a dead zone, technically? Jeez, so many of them. I mean, I, I can't imagine after like two or three years, the entire planet suddenly hospitable again. So, I don't know. So those eggs I got were crab squid, or not crab squid, um... That's cool. Squid sharks. Oh boy! That was a, a little bit tighter than I thought it was. Screw it. I'm an idiot, sorry. So, squid sharks, so... Ow. Like one of the ones around my base, currently. Awesome! I actually really like that, uh, creature. Let's dock. See if uh, Alan has anything to say. Welcome aboard, Captain. Thank you. All right, let's take a look at it. Oh, look at him—he's tiny. Yeah, he's still growing. Look at the little guy. I am about to get rid of these things because they're not growing anymore. All right, I think that's uh pretty much it. How's my energy doing? That's so good. I do need to make those planters though. All right. Oop. There is. There it is. Alright, 
we're gonna place them in here. I always recommend using these to grow the precedence delights, though. They're just easier to use. Alright. Boop. Boop. Oh, I need the actual fruit. Okay. These are to make the salads. What to demonstrate? Well, that one's gonna grow soon, so. I mean, it's easier to uh, pick the fruit with these things. What am I doing in here? I, I need to put a fabricator in there just, just as my cooking spot. And here. Salad! Fruit salad does not traditionally involve leaves, but at least it is nutritious and warming. Yep! And what's best is also. It doesn't spoil! I once had my uh, sea trucks food sod uh, just filled with these things. So yeah, 100 body heat, 85 food, 30 hydro. As a comparison, 75 food, this is more food than the nutrient blocks. 35 water, a little under a full large, or a disaffected water bottle. The larger ones give you about 50. And I've been using these to keep my health up. So, comparison. Yeah. These are so much better. Just boop. And I'm good. So, yeah. That's kind of... It's kind of great. I don't need to worry about water, really, anymore, either. So, yeah. That's pretty much what I'm worrying about off screen, just filling that out. I'm gonna deposit, I'll throw this away. My whole shtick for the rest of uh, off screen is to uh, load up this fridge. Probably get rid of this and put the uh, unair fabricator right here to cook. And, uh, yeah, about it. Um, if I do go down to Marguerite's uh, base again, though, I can get a uh, toilet, a shower, and a stovetop uh, customiz customization thing. They serve no purpose other than uh, decoration. So, yeah. I'm going to get that because I like decking my base out. But, that's it for now. I hope you guys enjoyed this set. And I'll see you guys next time when we will continue from here. We might be going to land next time. Not sure yet. But till then, I hope you guys have a great day. Bye-bye.